So this is the computer setup for capturing our weather station data with the um, National Instruments DAC, our makeshift wiring, and our LabVIEW VI, which is recording. As you can see, the progress is at 98%, so we have a couple more hours to go. And uh, we have displays of temperature, relative humidity, static pressure, wind speed, wind direction, and this has been recording for almost three days. And this here is a wind compass. So if we get wind, a vector points uh, with varying direction and magnitude in the direction of the wind, kind of like on a golf video game. So here are the weather stations. Um, we have them mounted on these poles. Ours is the one with the giant ridiculous looking roof. And we've captured almost three days of data with it, but however, uh, we've had some issues. One was the whole weather station decided to spin around, which we think is because of the roof, um, creating a lot of wind sail area. And the other issue is that our wind direction indicator, you might not be able to tell right now, doesn't always point in the right direction. It works. <laughs> um, we think this is because we don't have enough sail area on the back of the wind direction indicator, so we're going to be taking this whole thing down after we capture our three days of data and taking off the roof and modifying our wind direction indicator so that we can hopefully get to point correctly. Alright, that's good. This is a shot of the underside of our weather station showing how the roof attaches with some muffler clamps that are welded to uh, some sheet metal, as you can kind of see up there. And that is attached to the roof, which is made of like an ABS plastic via some uh, self-tapping sheet metal screws. And these end caps are also, uh, that is actually made out of an old computer case, sheet metal cut up and bent. Oh no, I'm, a, I'm just in camera mode now. You know, camera mode! Okay. That's good. <laughs> this, smushed this. brass. Yeah, maybe you should narrate it. Maybe you should narrate this it. This is our smushed brass. Which? We smushed it ourselves in the vice. And what are we using it for? Oh, it's going to be the tail of our WDI, also known as a wind direction Sorry. indicator. Yeah. Very cool. So, yeah, apparently. So we are removing the roof of our weather station right now, so... It hopefully won't twist in the wind so much anymore. The camcorder is not part of our weather station budget, right? That'd be bad. That would be bad. That would put us just a little bit. <laughs> but then I can get reimbursed for it. I'll talk, put talk putting them into reimbursing me. <laughs> well, we. Goodbye, I've seen something. You'll see us just pop out. Yeah, like that. Okay. So we know that. Radius of this is 0.1. So you can, you can see that the center of this is 0.1 away from the front of the keyboard. Shiny. I can pull this up. You know, as you tighten up, you just, you just loosen it a little bit and just drop this guy down. Okay. Up. Okay, tighten. Well, we can move it. Oh, we can move it, right. Ooh, that's pretty good with it. I think it's a Yeah, I see the little thing in the well. That's it. We do this. We do this up to what? 300. Okay. And then we go down. We go.
months ago. Oh, this usually never happens. Cool. You do have a little bit of an accent. <laughs> Using other right? Huh? Yeah, using. I hope so. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I think that's the last word. Not really, really loose threads. I think there might be a possibility that I'm through. Uh, you probably are. <laughs> Over here. Yeah, you're through. Okay. Now we answer. Search for the quarter inch nut continues. Ryan's frustration level peaks <laughs> as we cannot find the nut. But we have an idea of where it might be located. I believe the nut is on the top of the Mmm. Shall we investigate? Lifted like this. I will hold it. Thank you. This is gonna be the longest video that no one's gonna wanna watch. <laughs> I'm not putting the whole thing up on YouTube. <laughs> not out there. I'm playing on trimming it. <laughs> Substantially. We are on negative battery, but still going strong. That's good. Definitely giving that camera a workout for its first, uh, <laughs> first day. Yep. now the morning after you saw us working on the weather station last night and we're approximately 25% done recording our new set of data and if we take a look outside you can see our weather station and you can see that we have some actual weather approaching us so it should be an interesting three days of data to come Hello. All you basically, mi basically missed from yesterday was us erecting the actual weather station, which you see behind me, with our new modified wind direction indicator, which will hopefully provide much better data than our original design. And all that's really left for us now is to capture an extra three days of data and run some statistical analysis on it and write an approximately 70-page engineering report. So wish us luck and thank you for watching. Do you have any comments on today's events, Josiah? Um, yes. I'd just like to say that um, purple hippopotamus, it was just unbelievable. I couldn't believe what happened. Really surprising. I didn't expect it, but you know. It happens.